Dearly beloved, greetings in the name of Jesus Christ. Do you see the Lord's creation? This flower is very famous in Japan. They call it hydrangea and the same flower is in many different colors. I can see it in three to four colors. It surprised me greatly. Even in a single plant, this flower blooms in different colors. Do you see? How wonderful the greatness of the Lord's creation is. Don't we paint our homes in different colors? Where did they find these colors from? Man thinks and discovers colors from the colors that the Lord has given. So the Lord God is the proof for all these colors. He has created flowers, plants and leaves in beautiful colors. The Lord has said there are such beautiful colors. Sun, see and enjoy it, isn't it? Very delightful and surprising to see this. Very happy. Okay. If you ask what does the Lord say now in Psalm chapter 116 verse 8. A man of God looks unto the Lord and makes a beautiful prayer. You should make that prayer. What is the prayer? For you have delivered my soul from death, my eyes from tears and my feet from falling. Praise you Lord. In this way, he remembers what the Lord has done, thanks and praises him in prayer. Now here's three things. Praise you for delivering my soul from death. What brings about the death of the soul? Sin. Sin brings death to the soul. The Lord God protects our souls. In the world we live in, Satan tries to stain our souls with many sins and bring death to our souls. And the Lord God protecting our souls is indeed a great blessing. Praise you for delivering my soul from death. You have delivered my eyes from tears. Some will always keep crying. You were always crying before. Are you crying now? At one time, Hannah was always crying. Didn't the Lord God put a full stop to her tears? He blessed her. Her reproach was changed after that Hannah didn't cry. So he puts an end to tears. One day the Lord said to me, many years ago, you shouldn't cry for yourself. You shouldn't cry for your matters. If your tears are shed, it should be for the country, souls and others. You shouldn't cry for yourself. I committed saying, yes, Lord. From that day, the Lord God has kept my eyes from tears. But at the same time, I shed tears daily for souls, nations and others. Then God doesn't like that you are crying for your matters. He puts an end to tears. He delivers the eyes from tears. Praise Him for that. He delivers our feet from falling. Satan will cause stumbling to push us down. You will be serving the Lord God well. He will try to make you fall. You will be growing in your business. He will try to cause your business to fall. You will keep being promoted at work. He will try to make you fall. The children will keep achieving in their studies. He will think to make them fall. Satan causes stumbling always. He places stones and makes you stumble and fall. In your life it happened in the beginning, but now the Lord is protecting you. He commands His angels to protect your feet from stumbling over the stones. The Lord protects us from falling. We should think of all this and thank the Lord God. We should thank Him. Dear Lord, You keep my eyes from tears. You have kept my soul from sin. You have kept my feet from falling. Many praises to You, Lord. In the name of Jesus, Amen, Amen.